All right, I've been uh, doing this convention center now many times. I've been to this convention center dozens of times between this show and others, and I think I'm finally getting the hang of it. You have North, Central, South, Lower South, Upper North, Gold Lot, Purple Lot, Monorail. This place is a city in itself. In fact, you can walk in one door and out the other, and the weather can be different on either end. Now, if there's anyone that knows how to navigate these show uh, floor halls, it is Creative Cow's Ryan Salazar. Let's see what he was up to today. Hey guys, it's Ryan Salazar here for Creative Cow. Boy, I've got a great day lined up. Two interviews, one including a huge announcement that you're about to see. Let's take a look. How's it going, Vince? I'm doing pretty good, Ryan. Nice to talk with you again. Um, tell me about your announcement today. Well, it's a, it's a big deal for us. It's a collaboration with uh, Dolby um, and Philips uh, with the Cameron Pace Group. And what we're doing, which is unique to the industry, is we're taking the content creation, the tools that work on the content creation side, mm -hmm. and bridging the gap all the way to the display device, uh, promoting uh, glasses-free stereo, you know, wow. auto stereoscopic experience. We all are so used to the glasses. We're so used to 3D being a technology barrier. And I think today you're witnessing that disappearing, where you just walk up in front of a display, and join with a friend, and right. you start commenting on the images and experience. Excellent. Well, thank you so much, Vince. It was excellent talking with you. We have Mark Hamaker from Autodesk. Hey, Ryan. Good to see you. Good to see you. So since the, uh, the launch of the product last year into beta mode for everyone, how's it, how's it been? A lot of feedback? Uh, what I was blown away by is the feedback that we got. And, you know, one of the things you're going to see from us is you build better products when you listen to the people that are using them or that want to use them. So, you know, you'll still see major releases, but we're hoping to also be able to iterate very quickly. You know, we just released Smoke in December, so it's still a very new product. But we've actually had a couple of service pack updates to fix bugs, improve some performance and stability. So, you know, we're, we're pretty excited to, to get it out there, but, but also to be working with the community. And, Mark, I, w I heard you were given an award last night for our Smoke, right? Yeah, well, uh, I accepted the award uh, from Studio Daily for Smoke, and it was a Best in Show award, and that's really satisfying because, you know, the validation from uh, from the media, uh, but in, from the people, and just the excitement that's that's going on here, you know, it, it's fantastic. We're super happy. Excellent. Well, it was excellent seeing you. Great. Have a great rest of your NMB. Wow, what a great day. Tomorrow we've got all sorts of stuff lined up, uh, broadcast, post-production equipment, and we'll be talking to someone from the motion picture industry. There's a lot of great stuff for you to see here at NAB Show 2013. Be sure to tune in tomorrow at 4.30. This is Ryan Salazar signing off. Wow, that was some great coverage from Ryan. And I am still trying to figure out what that Shark Tank booth display is all about. I'm glad he included it in his piece. Uh, he's also a good guy to follow on Twitter, at Ryan Salazar. This is one of the biggest shows on TV, and at this year's NAB show, American Idol was inducted into the Broadcasting Hall of Fame.